Welcome back to another video. I'm your tech guide, Wayne. In the video today, I'm gonna to walk you through how to unlock your Samsung Galaxy A53 so you can use it with any carrier. The first thing you'll need to do is go to the phone app and make sure you're on keypad. You're gonna type in star, pound, zero, six, and pound. That's gonna show us the IMEI. You'll need to write down that first number at the top right here. We're gonna use that in the next step of the video. Next, we're gonna hit the home button. And we're gonna to go to Google Chrome, to the website, theunlockingcompany.com, and we're just gonna fill out a few prompts. First will be manufacturer, which will be Samsung. Next, we'll look for our A53, and we'll just need to slide up. So you'll actually search under Galaxy, Galaxy A53. And you'll notice there's a lot of galaxies. Here we go, Galaxy A53. Tap unlock now. On the next screen, you'll ask a few more questions specifically about where you purchased the phone. So uh, it should ask about the country, which is right here. We'll select United States. And then the carrier is gonna be AT&T. Hit next. On the last screen, we'll be entering our IMEI that we got from the first step of the video. We're gonna swipe up. We'll type in our IMEI in this box, full name, the email address of where you want your delivery instructions sent, and a contact number. Now, just to show you, if we swipe up a little bit more here, this is how much it'll cost to unlock the phone, just $29.99 and it takes about a day for them to send you the unlocking instructions. One thing to keep in mind is that unlocking phones, the process does change from time to time. So that's why I don't show the full process in the video, but once you go in and hit order now and um, submit the order, they will send you an email that'll have all the final instructions for you to unlock the phone. And one more important thing to note, at the top of the screen here, you'll find a toll-free number and a number to text so you can reach out to follow up on your order if you've gotten past that order window and still haven't gotten a response. And also, if you look on the first page of the website, they do offer a 100% money back guarantee in the event they're not able to unlock your phone. Sometimes things happen, and if so, you will get a refund on what you've spent. So that's it, guys. Now the very last thing is, uh, once you get those instructions, it's probably gonna ask you to do two things. Um, it's gonna ask you to restart the phone um, or sometimes putting in a new SIM card will automatically restart the phone, so FYI there. Um, you may need to pop out your old SIM card and put in the SIM card of the service you want to use the phone with. For example, I just unlocked it for AT&T and now I want to use it with my T-Mobile service, so I have my T-Mobile SIM card here and I can use my SIM card pin to basically pop out the old SIM card. Now on this phone, you'll find that slot on the right side, or excuse me, at the uh, bottom, the very bottom here. This is where you'll find the SIM tray. And you'll just use this pin to pop it out, put in the new SIM card, um, and that's it. So, hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care, and as always, have a good one.